Boom. What up, everybody? Yo, I just wanted to come live real quick and let everybody know. If you don't know, you should know. The brand new video, Heart Emojis, is out now. I've got so many uh, incredible and hilarious messages from people today who have seen the video. Um, man, I, the last two videos, No Good Bastards and Church, both did a million views in 24 hours. So that's my goal right now. We're at the halfway point. Uh, the counter on YouTube is stuck right now. The counter at YouTube has been stuck for like 40 minutes at like 460,000 or something. Like, I don't know why that always happens to our videos, but for some reason, like they climb, 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 climb. And then all of a sudden they just stop dead and they stay frozen for a while. So I don't know what the views on the new video are actually at, but I'm guessing that we're probably pretty close to half a million. I think we're probably around 500,000 right now. So the last two videos, No Good Bastards and Church, both did a million in 24 hours. I really want this heart emojis video to hit a million uh, in 24 hours. So please, I've been saying this for three weeks. I'm sounding like a broken record, I get it, but please go watch that new video, Heart Emojis, uh, and share it like crazy. Uh, send it to your exes. If that's, if that's gonna make you watch it, go do it. I personally wouldn't recommend it. I don't know if you wanna open up that can of worms right now, um, but if, if it means you're gonna go watch it and you're gonna share the video, if you have to share it with your ex, just go do it. Um, so watch that video, watch heart emojis, share it everywhere you can, post it on your Facebooks, post it on your Instagrams, post it on your Twitters, dedicate it to the people that you used to be in love with that you hate now, um, all that. So it's kind of cool because like, we've been doing super controversial music for like a while now, whether that was fake woke or clown world or canceled or no lives matter or blah, 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 blah. And because we've been doing this music, we haven't been put on the YouTube trending charts in quite a while until today. I just found out that we are number five. We are trending at number five on YouTube. It's the first time that we've been on the YouTube trending charts in probably six months, which is pretty freaking cool. Who knew all you had to do was wear a pink shirt and sing a pop punk song and they'd put you right back on trending. They're really not gonna like what I do next, but we're on the trending charts at number five for like the first time in six months with heart emojis. So that's pretty cool. And um, top five, I mean, we're within striking distance of that number one spot right now. So after YouTube allows your video to be on the trending charts, the only thing that can affect those trending charts now are numbers. So we need to rack views right now. And if you guys go out there and if you guys watch the video and you share the video and you start racking the views up, we'll climb in the YouTube trending charts. I think we could probably hit number one with this one. There wasn't that many other big artists that released videos today, so we should have a pretty clear shot at the number one spot on YouTube trending if we keep watching and sharing. So please, um, if you guys are out there and you're bored, you're home from work, the kids are in bed, or you're just ignoring them, uh, you got nothing to do tonight, I got nothing to do tonight. I'm gonna sit around and watch the video and share the video and promote the video. If you have time, right underneath this live stream, on this video, on this Facebook page, is the new video, Heart Emojis. So take, take, take 30 seconds, go to my Facebook page, scroll down to the post underneath this one, and share Heart Emojis. Post it to your Facebook pages, post it anywhere you can. Um, I'd really like to get that number one spot. So I told you guys this was gonna be a way different type of video, man. I tried to warn everybody for a week, I said, yo, this one's gonna be weird. I know I said No Good Bastards was gonna be different, and it was. And I, I know I said Church was gonna be different, and it was. But I told you guys this was going to be the most different video out of all of them. And I mean, I didn't lie. I, I think it caught a lot of people off guard today. Not a lot of people expected it. Um, but I felt like No Good Bastards was so like in your face and boom, 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 boom. And church was so serious and like pulling at the heartstrings and kind of wrenching your gut because it was it was such a personal serious song. 
I thought for the third slice of cherry pie, why don't we just have a little fun? Why don't we just do a fun music video and, and, and order a bunch of pizza and a bunch of soda and jump around on the counters and play guitar and scream at the top of our lungs and, and wear bright colors and just have fun. So I, I thought it was time that w w maybe we take a step back from doing the, the, the super serious stuff and just and just do something to have fun, do something that feels good. Lord knows the world is in a crazy crazy state right now it's been in a crazy state for the last year with everything that's been going on um we need it we need a few we need a few smiles you know we we, we, we need we need a we need a sweet release at some point um and I, and I thought that heart emojis would be the, the the funny the funny fun song that would put a smile on people's faces so i really hope you guys enjoyed it man um it was a really fun one to record, really fun to shoot the video. And it was pretty nerve wracking, honestly, putting this video out into the world. And this is our last video. Anybody that's been tuned in knows that we're doing the whole three week experience right now. Uh, different type of music from me, not political, not viral, not aggressive, not even rap. It's been, it's been two rock songs and now a punk pop song. Um, and, and heart emojis was the last was the third installment in our three weeks of surprises and our three weeks of different type of music. Heart Emojis was our last slice of cherry pie. I really hope you guys enjoyed this last three weeks, man. It was super liberating for me uh, to do something completely different. Um, and it was really fulfilling for me to, 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 to be able to express myself artistically in a different way. Um, and I'm just, I'm so thankful for all of you guys that have come along for the ride and watched the videos and shared them and sent me messages and commented and told me how much you love them. Um, it really, it really like really just means the world to me, man. You know, there's a lot of people out there who say Tom McDonald's nothing but a clickbait artist. He only gets views cause he's controversial. Like he's trash, blah, 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 blah. So a part of me just wanted to show those people, look. I'm gonna make a rock song. I'm gonna make a pop song. I'm gonna make a punk song, and 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 I'll and I'll and I'll be fine. I don't have to be the angry rapper, controversial guy. Even though that's who I am. Like I love doing that. It's a huge part of who I am. But to be able to do things like we've done for the last three weeks and still have them be this successful is incredible. To all those people who said out there who said, you know, he's a clickbait rapper, he's a controversial rapper, that's the only reason he gets views. We just got two number ones on the Billboard rock charts and the Billboard alternative charts. Those people can kiss my fucking ass. And to all the people out there who have enjoyed the cherry pie and love the last three weeks and uh, three week experience, um, I, I love you guys so much, man. Thank you. I would be lying if I said I wasn't worried about how these last three weeks were going to play out on social media. I was worried about the views on the videos. I was worried about the downloads. I was worried that people were going to hate the music. I was worried that I was going to lose fans for trying something new. And that's just all internal stuff that every artist uh, deals with. And you guys did not let me down. I felt like I was crashing towards planet Earth at a million miles an hour. And once again, you guys caught me and, and put me back on my feet and I appreciated it. Thank you, I love you. Um, so yeah, heart emojis is out now and it's not, the, it's not the last surprise. I know I told you guys that I have three surprises and that was the three week experience. That was the three slices of cherry pie. And I would, I, normally I would never lie to you guys, but I lied to you guys. I got two more surprises left. So our job right now, in order to make it to those two surprises, I'm baiting you right now. I'm trying to convince you. If you guys want the next two surprises, please do me a mother freaking favor um, and go watch the heart emojis video and share it. Um, post it everywhere you can on your Facebooks, your Instagrams, your Twitters, your TikToks. Send it to your friends. Send it to your exes if that's what you got to do. Uh, just spread it like wildfire. Spread this thing like a virus. 
And I, I think you guys all know a little bit about viruses from this last year and a half. So spread this thing like a virus. I would appreciate it. Spread it like a wildfire. Um, I really want to hit that 1 million in 24 hours. We have, um, I don't know, how many hours do we have left? We got a few hours left. And we're about halfway there. We're at 500K approximately. So please take the 30 seconds, go watch that video and share it. Push it out there into the world by any means necessary. Let's get that 1 million views in 24 hours. Let's, uh, let's get from number five to number one on the trending charts on YouTube. And also, um, we're number four on the iTunes charts in hip hop with a pop punk song, which once again is uh, really cool. So as you guys know, I announced a couple days ago, No Good Bastards just got two number ones that made it onto seven billboard charts. That means I'm getting a billboard plaque for No Good Bastards. I get to put that in my girlfriend's hands. I get to put that in my best friend's hands because clearly they were on the songs with me. Um, and to be able to get a billboard plaque for my best friend and my girlfriend, I think that's probably the highlight of my career thus far. It's really incredible. I think I might even photocopy the billboard chart and then put them in with your guys' t-shirts and album orders uh, for the next six months because I want you guys to hang those plaques on your walls because they're, they're yours as much as they are mine. So I guess if me on here telling you, yo, go download heart emojis, share heart emojis, blah, 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 if that don't work, Look at what you guys did for No Good Bastards. You guys got me two number ones for No Good Bastards. You guys got me charting on seven billboard charts for No Good Bastards. And the reason why those billboard charts happened is because of your watches, your shares, your posts, your downloads, your streams, all of those things all come together and they all add up and that's what becomes the information that Billboard takes so you can chart on Billboard. So I hope you guys realize how big of an impact your watches and shares and views and downloads and streams, I hope you realize how big of an impact they're actually having. Because it's literally at this point, it's, it's, it's immeasurable. Like it cannot be measured. And I've heard it a lot of times in the last three months. I've never said it myself. There's been quite a few people, respectable people in the industry that have told me, yo, dude, you're the biggest independent artist in North America right now. It's crazy. Um, and I have you guys to thank for that. I might be the machine. I might be the, the machine that's moving and making the videos and putting them on the, and writing the songs and putting them on the internet. But you guys are the gasoline that runs the machine. Without you guys, my machine would be like, and then it would, that's where it would stop. The machine wouldn't run because it would be out of gas. So you guys are the gas. I appreciate you. You're an absolutely essential part of this operation. We're winning right now. It's crazy. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to come and say what up. I usually live stream uh, the day that a video releases so I can come on here and grab my phone and tell you guys, yo, go share the new video. Go watch the new video. Download the new video. Stream the new song. Um, so that's why I'm here. I'm here to rally the troops, baby. So please do it so I don't have to come on here in three hours from now and ask you guys to do it again. I'm going to be in my story in about 45 seconds saying all of the same shit over again in my Instagram story and my Facebook story because doing relentless social media is just like a super cool part of my job that I have to do every day. <sighs> but it's necessary. As an independent artist, social media is the, the, the greatest tool um, available to us. So I'm trying to use it right now. I'm trying to let you guys know the new video, Heart Emojis, is out right now. The new video, Heart Emojis, is out right now. Go watch that video. Go share that video. Post it on your Facebooks. Post it on your Instagrams. Put it in your stories. Tag me in all your posts. Uh, download the song on iTunes or wherever you download music. It doesn't matter where you download it from, but if you download it, it counts towards the Billboard charts. 
We'll get more into that over the next few days. For now, I really want to get that million views in, in 24 hours. So please, if you guys would be so kind, right underneath this live stream on this page is the video for heart emojis. Go watch it, go share it, send it to your ex, send it to your homie that just got dumped. Whatever you guys can do, let's get this thing out there. Let's go viral, let's blow it up, let's download it, let's hit number one trending on YouTube, let's hit number one on iTunes, all that. It's really mind blowing that like, I spent the last three years writing rap songs and they're becoming more and more and more and more and more successful. I never would have dreamed a year ago that I'd be sitting here now uh, releasing rock and punk songs and having them uh, and pop songs and having them do as well as they're doing right now. It's, it's really fries my brain, man. And, and, I, and I owe it to you guys, so thank you very much. Um, but that was our last slice of cherry pie. I'm gonna go back to uh, pissing off the internet and, uh, and, and being controversial being controversial for using common sense and speaking the truth in songs. Weird, I know. But I'm gonna go back to my solo rap stuff here like right away. This was our last slice of cherry pie. Like I said, I have two more surprises for you guys. Uh, I'm really, really, really excited to give them to you. One of, the, one of the surprises is on its way to my house right now, which was probably gonna confuse you even further about what that surprise is, but uh, Trust me, you guys are gonna be excited. I'm really excited. Um, I'm gonna go say all of this stuff that I just said. I'm gonna say it again in my Facebook story right now. Um, and yeah, I hope everybody is having an amazing Friday evening. Uh, if you're having a bad Friday evening, then just go watch heart emojis. It'll make you happy and it'll make you smile. That's what it's there for. So uh, please, everybody out there, I love y'all. It's Hangover Gang Forever. Please go watch and share the heart emojis video. Download it on iTunes. But most importantly, share, 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 share the video. I love you guys. Heart emojis out now. Boom. It's Hangover Gang Forever. Love y'all. Peace.